Good morning, Good morning. ladies who are smart, beautiful, powerful, successful, fierce, and gentlemen of taste and discernment. Thank you for joining <laughs> us. And let me just say to my friend Marilyn Alverio, thank you for bringing me to this incredible event that is going to inspire and empower the women and men who are here today and who are watching from all over the world. I'm so inspired by the great work that Marilyn does for the Latina community in Connecticut, in the Northeast, in our country, and now the world. It's awesome. A round of applause for Marilyn Alberto. So this is a big deal. This is the 18th year. It is the largest event bringing Latinas together in New England. And it has reached more than 10,000 and counting women since it began. So I am so honored to be here on behalf of not just myself, but also Governor Lamont, who sends his regards because, uh, ladies and gentlemen, you are a critical and growing part of our state. Marilyn alluded to the census, but um, your community is the largest ethnic group in our state, and we are so proud to have you in our beautiful state and to represent you every day. Now, this symposium, is going to give you the opportunity to see new possibilities, to explore whether it's in your career or your profession or your own personal growth, or perhaps it's to explore becoming an entrepreneur. Uh, but even beyond that, this is an opportunity for our young people and young ladies from Hartford High, can you raise your hand so everybody can see you? They are gonna be taking all of this in and hopefully leaving inspired and empowered. So ladies, we know that often we have to work harder than men to prove ourselves, and we have to keep fighting to break through the glass ceilings that sadly are still out there in our state and our country. And by the way, that is what I say my mission is every day, because as Lieutenant Governor, one of the things that I do is I run the Governor's Council on Women and Girls, with all of our cabinet secretaries. And I say that my mission is to fight for more equality and opportunity for everyone in our state every day. And that is what we are doing right here. We are making sure that you are empowered and have more knowledge and more tools to succeed in whatever it is that you are doing. Now, I have to say, if you're from Connecticut, you gotta check out this beautiful mural that's on the CRT building. And it's got some incredible women on it. It has our Vice President, Kamala Harris, it has the first woman governor of Connecticut, Ella Grasso, it has Ruth Bader Ginsburg, it has Justice Sotomayor, and it has Michelle Obama. And it's incredible. It goes across the face of a huge building that's four stories tall. And we just dedicated it 
a week or two ago. And I wanted to uh, give you a quote from Justice Sotomayor um, because I think it's what today is about. And she said this, she said, I think it's important to move people beyond dreaming into doing. They have to be able to see that you are just like them and you made it. So that's exactly what you're gonna be doing today. You're gonna be listening and learning from some incredibly successful leaders and young ladies from Hartford. If you see it, you can be it. So ladies and a few gentlemen, it's such a delight to be here with you. I hope you have a very successful uh, uh, symposium today and I wish you every success and if there is ever anything the governor and I can do for you you just let me know Marilyn knows where to find me it's an honor to represent you